What do you guys do? Monkey Pie Toys. Bad Boy Day. DC Mephire Maker Figure. This is Killer Crab from Batman Arkham Asylum. If you haven't played this game, I suggest you do so. Amazing game. He has a great part in it. I really like the game, so I was really happy to get this figure. And if you go to Target, it's half off. So I got this for the cost of a basic figure. 20 bucks. So worth it. Look at that big boy right there. I have heard there is a little bit of issues with the joints. I'm hoping mine isn't. But also, if you give this a black wash, it looks so great because it adds a lot of detail. So, let's open this bad boy up. The following Thursday. Once again, we're back. We got this thing open. And before I get into it, as always, the car character will show me back. If you pause this, There's the right. Now, you can read that, but there you go. So, as always, I do like the card, I collect it. I like that you got a concept from the game, not the toy itself. So, you changed it, I like that. So, we'll put that over here. Let's get into the figure. As I said before, loose. George in the shoulder, which it has, is very loose. I can move it, which just by touching it. I can, doesn't have any resistance at all. Rob even tried it. He's doing it. He's pinning me around. I can do a good job, but... You want me to come over and do it? No, you can do it. But yes, it's loose and bad. So, if you have some fix the joint stuff at home, my mom put it in there and gum up the shoulders because this is just, ah, uh, I'm very disappointed in that at the moment. But as with all big fire figures, it is top heavy, so posing it, I would suggest a stand, but if you do too much fun, like so, that's what's going to happen to you. Top heavy, so if I pose it, I will put one foot out to balance it, kind of shift that way a little bit, like that. The detail itself is awesome. Let me show it to you guys. Look at that amazing detail, that amazing scope. I guess that a black wash will make all this detail pop, which I'm going to do 100% with this figure. If you don't know what Black Watch is, I'll make you a, a monkey pie tip. I'll be interested in seeing that. And we can do a Black Watch. So, Rob said he will film it because he's interested. So, we'll do a Black Watch. But, kind of disappointed with the joints. That that's going to take away from my review. I like the scope. I like the look. I like how it's a big figure, but I'm just so hurt by this loose joints. It's kind of a bummer. I don't like how the biceps don't have a swivel, so you can't turn it. It's just straight. They cut to Hey, I'm bummed about that. It's the okay figure. 
for 20 bucks a day worth it. So, okay. So, I'm going to get into my review. At 10, I'm going to give this a 6 because the joints, the bicep swivel, the top heavy part, give me a 6. What do you got, Rob? I'm also going to give it a 6 for the same reasons. Yeah, there we go. So, do you have this figure? What do you think about what some of the tricks you did to fix it? I'll do a couple of videos for tight joints, black wash, stuff like that. But that's what I'm saying. Time to set it up. Links Monkey Ball Toy Store. I'll put the address below. We have a couple of these in the shop. I, I'm not going to say don't get it. Hopefully you get a better one than I did with tight joints. So, till next time, like, share, subscribe, happy hunting.